this is Steve with fuelit.com and today we're going to go over the removal of your stock fuel pressure regulator and that's this right here. In order to do that the first thing you want to do is access the passenger side of the tank and disconnect power to your LPF peak. Start the car and let the car run out of fuel and die naturally and that will release the pressure in the fuel lines. Then disconnect all of the plumbing connections on the passenger side so that you're able to remove the filter assembly. Then move over to the driver's side of the car on the back seat and then you'll find the filter assembly. The first thing you'll need to do is remove the fuel line from the filter assembly and in order to do that you will push in on the fuel line, hold the gray tab back and then just pull the fuel line straight out. After that you'll remove the metal ring and then pull the filter assembly out of the tank as you feed the lines from the passenger side out through the driver's side. And then when you turn this over you will find that the, the fuel pressure regulator and then we'll need to take the cover off the fuel pressure regulator just push those two tabs out, push down on it and then you can remove and discard this line, you will not use that line anymore. Then you will remove the ground connection so you'll go ahead and push in on this little tab and just disconnect the ground connection like that. You'll then take and pull down and rotate uh, the fuel pressure regulator and this tube will work its way out of there. As you see it's fairly long so just keep working its way out. Then once you've done that you can then insert the plug that is just a Teflon sealed uh, stainless steel bolt and then you'll insert that in through the opening in the bottom of the filter assembly and then for the electrical connection you'll go ahead and cut that little spade connector off of there and then uh, connect the new ring terminal so that as you thread that in you uh, complete that ground circuit and then after that you'll go ahead and reinstall it and that completes the uh, fuel pressure regulator defeat for the uh, stage 3 with port injection and uh, return line. Thanks for watching.